Hi guys, my name is Mikey Polis, and today we're going to be changing out the, the drain plug, a two inch brass garboard drain plug assembly on a Stingray boat. <laughs> I couldn't do it. What's up y'all, welcome back to Mikey Polis. Today we're doing some maintenance, I guess you could call it. So as you guys know, the big part of my channel is being on the water. And one of my main tools for doing that is, as you can tell behind me, my boat. We're gonna do some maintenance and put in a brand new drain plug assembly. Uh, picked it up at West Marine. So we're not obviously a how-to channel. I'm not explaining, telling people how to do things, doing instructional stuff. But I am gonna show you guys today on um, how to do a two-inch drain plug assembly. So I'll bring you over to the boat. I started, I took off um the old one yesterday and i put on i'm using a little 3m uh it's the 5200 it's an uh, adhesive sealant super fast curing um so i put that on i filled some of the the holes last night i cleaned it and then i put the holes on because it's got to cure for 24 hours but for you guys down here as you can tell i took the old plug out i cleaned the surface of it i prepped the surface of it and then i put that 5200 on there so what I'm gonna show you guys today and what we're gonna to do today is we're gonna put the new one on. So we'll get it in place, then we're gonna mark the holes with a permanent marker. We're gonna drill them out with a 1 8 drill bit and we're just gonna drill pilot holes because obviously we don't want the fiberglass to crack when we're putting our mounting screws in to hold it on. So I'll show you guys kind of step by step how to change drain plug assembly on a fiberglass boat. So with that, let's get to it. Give you guys a little beautiful uh, bird's eye view of the. I call this I call, instead of a drain plug. I call this the butthole of the boat. If you notice, looks like a butthole. So, I cleaned the surface. I got it all cleaned up, prepped, filled it with the 5200. So what I'm actually going to do is the old holes were here, here, and here on my old assembly. So the new one, I, instead of lining up with the holes exactly, I'm gonna alternate them. So we're gonna go like this. So then the holes are in slightly different spots and I'm going into fresh fiberglass. So. Like this. Make three holes. I go one, two, three. We're going to remove the drain plug. And as you can tell, we got three new holes marked. So we got one, two, three, and they're alternating from the other, the old ones on the old drain plug. So now, I'm gonna grab the drill with the 1 8 drill bit and we're gonna pre-drill these pilot holes because again, we don't want the fiberglass to crack when we screw the new one in. So I got my drill, I got a 1 8 drill bit and I'm gonna just pilot hole these where I have it marked so we can get our new drain plug in, so. All right. New holes are drilled. Just make sure things line up. Everything lines up golden. See all the all the holes line up right with our perfect spot. So now what we're gonna do, you can join me I'm down here. Oh hi guys. Oh hi. Hi. Hello, we're sitting down under the back of the boat. <laughs> we're sitting down on the back of the boat. <laughs> so now, so I took the 3M, the 5200, and I put it in a Tylenol. If you're a parent, you have about probably 70 of these sitting around the house. So I put it in here just to make it a little easier um, when I'm prepping the surface. 
So I'm gonna go around the edge of the drain plug hole. I'm also gonna go on the back of here, set it on, and then we'll drill our, our hole, our screws in for the drain plug. All right, so we got it all filled up. Need it lined up here. All right, so I got the drain plug assembly in. Now we're gonna put in a few of these. We're gonna put in our holes, our screws in. I'm not going to, um, I'm just gonna get them in before I cinch them all tight. Put them in and get the holes all. Now let's put the last one in here. So now I'm going to tighten them all up. All right, so the drain plug is all in. Um, the new plug comes out nice and easy. I'm gonna put a bead of 5200 around the outside and then I'm gonna clean it up with my finger. Do some little bead here. And that's why I have my glove on. I'm gonna um, smooth it all out here in just a minute. All right, y'all. Drain plug assembly is in. Our new drain plug goes in with ease. We're all set. Now the key with this, the key with the 5200, it's fast curing. Um, 24 hours is the time. So what we, I wanted to do is I wanted to get it done and then let it cure so it can cure overnight. That way tomorrow afternoon we can put the boat back in, get it back on the lift and get back to our water adventures here on the lake. So thanks again for tuning in to today's video, guys. If you dig the content, please hit that thumbs up. If you've done something like this before or you need to do it and this video helped you guys out, please drop a comment down below and hit the, hit the thumbs up if it really did help you guys today. Make sure you hit that red subscribe button so you don't miss my next video. And with that, we'll see you on the next one, guys. Bye.